Good morning. This is Brittany from the Goddess Complex LLC. Today is October 2nd, 2024. I just did a duet with a certain young lady. Just happened she popped up on my uh, For You uh, timeline. And this is the whole point of a lot of us working in the spirit realm and also earth realm in different dimensions if you are that high vibrational. And I understand her, her, her digress and I understand her uh, point of view and everything. I'm kind of so, so tired of this. Whatever this agenda is, this was the whole point of everybody in the woke community, the religious, the spiritual, the magical communities of the world and universe, everything from the star seeds all the way to the galactic and cosmic beings. This is the whole point of preventing this right here. If you didn't know this particular doc, um, doc, doc workers, uh, situation. This is the second karmic return of it from 2020. This particular, um, this, per this was the whole point of fighting the damn Illuminati in 2020. Hi, I'm Brittany Wilson Jordan. You may know me as Pisces, Cleopatra, Medusa, the Empress, Queen, or the Queen from heaven. And all the star seed um, beings. You may know me as uh, several goddesses throughout time. One being Oshun and Aphrodite, Kalimak, Artemis, Nike, and several others like Mary Laveau. You also may know me as the Witch of Endor and several other um, beautiful magical guardian beings. Some of you already know. Um, I took transformation. Uh, this particular year to fight transformation. Don't don't confuse that with um, transgender transformation, because I'm a biological woman. Don't confuse that. I'm all woman, hundred percent. Girl turns into woman, turns into beautiful woman, magical woman. If you if you know that, I'm a biological woman, so don't confuse the two. Uh, but this was the whole point of activating so hard. To fight Lucifer, Satan, and the devil. A lot of people just found out that's what that feeling was during the pandemic. Us getting ready to uh, help God uh, handle some light work. Light work. Light work turned to heavy work because they were fighting against God. This is one of the agendas for the famine spell that the devil and Satan with Lucifer was getting ready to do. That It already happened in 2020. So I need to let you guys know. This right here pisses me off because we already fought these people. It was the actual, and for legal reason, the actual factual of the Illuminati dum-dums that did this ritual and with the Church of Satan and several other people. That's the whole point of fighting it was to prevent this particular, this particular thing happening. God wants the, you to know he's going to put them back to work. They're going to end up getting a raise early next year. There's no way you have to pay the workers. They're in a union. We have a presidency with Mr. Biden and Ms. Harris who support unions. They're going to tackle that. This is what we fought them for. If you are OG tarot reader, this popped up in your meditation, your prayer, your time with God. He gave you the download about this one during the pandemic or a couple years before the pandemic. Because a lot of the prophets and prophets were crying to tell them to, 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 to take this serious. Some of them cross over. Some of them are in heaven. They're on their way down to handle this business with God. We cannot have famine in Europe just like we cannot have famine here in America. Honey. Uh, there's no way the U.S. is going to go without food, import, export, and we're the biggest ones who support everybody's import, export, whatever you want to call it, markets. If we stop buying food and other stuff uh, imported to us, they're the other continents, their countries that, that are within those continents, they're going to crash. They almost crashed during 2020 and post-2020 up to 2023. They almost pa like crashed. There's a prayer I'm going to teach eventually, but it's closed practice. I prayed that prayer like God wanted me to. And uh, from this particular book that I have, he, I prayed this particular prayer. I hadn't prayed it again um, 
I only prayed it once after God guided me to pray that particular prayer. I don't understand. I don't understand. I, I just don't get it. I, I just don't get it. That's the whole point of fighting them in 2020. God had me pray that prayer. The famine in, in Paris, in certain places in Europe went away. The famine here in America and inflation went down and went away. The inflation uh, dropped just a little bit. Just, to, just to been, It's been dropping ever since then. It's more people grocery shopping. It's more people shopping here in America. Um, I didn't hear any any humbug about um, um, really anything poverty. We I don't even see um, homeless people, which is a blessing. I don't even see any homeless people anymore since I prayed that prayer. There's another prayer I prayed during the pandemic in 2020 and 2021 with a uh, really 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 heavy um, really heavy calendar work, and then I stopped the calendar work. Every prayer hits on. I'm just letting you know that. If you don't believe in magic, believe in the magic of prayer at least, and the magic of God. But this is the whole point of fighting the Illuminati people. This the whole point. This right here. This is one of them. This is the the plagues, the plagues, which would um, mark uh, Satan trying to uh, attempt to come to Earth, which he's forbidden. Just like Lucifer and the devil were forbidden. They snuck on earth this year. I mean, not this year, that year, which is 2020. It's currently 2024, post Satan's death, post the devil's death, and post Lucifer and all of hell. There's no more fallen angels, no more demons, no more entities, no more evil spirits. We fought them so we couldn't fight them anymore. We won at the beginning. They cheated by trying to return. This cannot come back to America this cannot go to Africa or Asia. This cannot go to South America. This can't go to Australia. This can't go to Antarctica or Europe. This can't go anywhere else, honey. Not to the islands, because this is going to affect the islands in Alaska to the point where they're going to shut down their countries and expedite them here or somewhere overseas in one of the other continents, continents and countries. Like, do you understand? Like, they can't survive. With now, like people, a uh, place like Alaska, places like Hawaii, places like uh, different parts of Asia, that have to have the import export, and places like Haiti and other 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 Caribbean countries and stuff, overseas and uh, on the islands. They count on certain stuff. Also, they can't make money because all the bananas and everything. Who's gonna eat fifteen million bananas over there? Who, who gonna eat fifteen bananas? Fifteen million bananas. Who? Their people already eat a lot of the fruit and things there naturally because they can actually go to the markets or even just, you know, they have a little, little community areas where they can just go pick fruit and things um, at their leisure. It just depends on which country and area, you know, because not all, all the countries over there allow you to just to go pick the fruit <coughs> for free. Because I heard a little story. Some people think you just go over there and pick the fruit. No, you have to ask. You have to at least ask. Certain areas are free, some are not. We can't allow this. Um, unfortunately, they have to pay the workers. Um, I don't know what program they set off, but God actually just destroyed whatever that was over there. Just destroyed whatever was, destroyed whatever was over there. They have no clue what's actually going on. Um, this is a result from whatever post-Illuminati downfall and, and destruction and death. There is no more Illuminati and none of the skull and bones, masons, whatever, whatever you want to call it. A lot of people still are, are practicing and wearing a lot of the, the emblems and dumbass stuff. There's no more of that. They, they're, they're, it, God, call, God calls them the fake Illuminati. All the original ones in their family um, that was a part of that Illuminati order, dead, there's no NWO, there's no more. If you join that stuff now, you're good as dead. Any type of satanic order or anything, dead. But this was one of the agendas. I'm kind of a little pissed off. I know it's going to turn in the other way. And we just need to make sure it turns in a good way. God is turning the wheel in their, the dark worker's favor. That way we don't have famine here in America. Because this is the agenda that God was talking about in the Bible.